Good morning loves and welcome to another at home vlog unfortunately but I think tomorrow I'm going to be going out because I want to pick up a few things from Matsumoto Kyoshi in Ikebukuro because they have good prices there and I need to start getting stuff that I want to stock up on before I leave Japan and my boyfriend asked me for a few things to grab from him that I can only really get there so I might do that and take you guys along with me tomorrow, but otherwise I have like no plans. Oh no, and I want to go gift shopping for some people because there's some birthdays coming up and I want to I wanna just get some gifts for people before I go. So yeah, I'm going to do that. And if you guys are curious about the makeup look that I have on right now, um, I filmed that today. So yeah, that's why I look like totally different. I got my Celotica lenses in, in Crystal, the Naturals ones. Um, they're really intense, like they change my eye color so drastically, like seriously. So I never really wear them outside, plus I find the naturals to be quite uncomfortable. Um, which is funny because they're called naturals, but they're totally like not wearable for every day, so yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna head to the grocery store and grab a few things and then I'll come back and show you guys a grocery shopping haul because I know how much you guys love when I do grocery shopping hauls. For some reason, like, I never... Like, I'm excited about showing you guys my groceries, but usually I do it whenever I'm, like, struggling for um, content to show you guys. Like, usually I do it when it's days like these where I don't go out because I'm saving money. But, um, yeah, I needed groceries because I had no more vegetables in my house. And when I have no vegetables, um, like, I don't know what to eat. Like, I'm just like, what do I do with myself? So, I'm going to go do that, and then I'll come back and show you guys what I got. All right, I'm back. Let me show you. It's heavy. This is so heavy, you guys. Like, my arms are killing me from that walk back. But let me show you what I got. I stocked up on some essentials that I will need for the last month here in Japan. So I'm hoping what I got will actually last me a month and I won't need to go back. But even if I do need to go back, I probably won't because there's going to be, like, no point. But yeah, let me show you what I got. Going into the first bag, I have my usual essentials such as my apple vinegar so i got my apple cider vinegar because i'm all out and this usually lasts me about a month because i drink it every day and i try to drink it every day as it helps my skin and my stomach and all that good stuff you guys it helps you like burn fat too so yep so i got that for adding to my water i also picked up more lemon juice because i add this along with the apple vinegar to my water a lot of people prefer fresh lemons but i'll be real you guys like I don't have enough fridge space for that and I also don't have enough counter space to manage that every single day. So I get this. Maybe when I go to Australia, I'll have a bigger fridge, I know that, and a bigger counter space and bigger everything. So maybe I'll start doing fresh lemons there. But for now, in Japan, this works for my household. Picked up some organic spaghetti um, just because this is like actually cheaper compared to like the bigger sized ones and i didn't need a big sized one because i don't eat that much spaghetti and i figured i would eat this around the end of the month mostly when like there's no more there's no more food right so i'm probably gonna eat mostly this i got two onions because i love onions and everything raw or cooked sauteed whatever onions and everything you guys i picked up more frozen pumpkin as you guys know i love this stuff and frozen spinach, my staple as well. Into the next bag, I bought a huge bundle of green leaf lettuce. And unfortunately, it's not clean, so I'm gonna have to like wash it. Mmm, such a pain. Then I also picked up a huge thing of tomatoes. This is the biggest one I've ever seen at that supermarket. So I was like, yes, sign me up. I don't know about you guys, but I love my tomatoes slightly underripe. Like, not underripe, but just ripe. So they're not that weird. You know when tomatoes get, like, a little overripe and they become, like, this granular texture? I hate that with passion. So I only like them when they're a bit underripe, I guess. Put in everything. I picked up two bags of these mini mozzarella balls because they are so good. So good. These are like my favorite. What are they called? Like bosa something? They're like actual Italian term for them. I don't know about you guys, but I love these with tomatoes and in everything. And believe it or not, this kind of cheese is low in lactose. So people who are 
lactose intolerant but not severely lactose intolerant can still eat these and it's a great source of vitamin B, like B vitamins. So yeah, I've been eating these a lot recently and they're friggin delicious. I picked up a pack of my favorite tofu here in Japan. This one is like grilled or charred a bit on each side. It's the best, like eat it, put it in everything, like salad, everything. I picked up two different types of sushi grade fish, one being salmon and the other one being tuna because I like to put it in my salads as well like I freaking love it in my salads you guys like little chunks of this uh in Korea I my favorite dish for lunch was hedokbap which is like um it's like rice salad with chunks of raw fish in it like sushi rice salad with like lettuce in it and a little bit of spicy sweet vinegar sauce is the best like I'm addicted to head up up you guys you have to try it but you can like make it like just just put this shit in everything <laughs> usually when i go grocery shopping i go hungry which i know is the number one thing you're not supposed to do is grocery shop when you're hungry but i always tend to do it because if i'm going to go grocery shopping i just i don't know i'm really bad i have no legitimate reason for it so yeah usually the day that i go grocery shopping i don't eat what I buy just because I tend to be really hungry so I want food right then and there. So usually it's not the healthiest food but this is like the only time that I do buy junk food and usually it's like not junk food it's just pre-made food. Um, some fried chicken just like four pieces of small fried chicken picked it up. And then I also got my usual favorite this gyoza. So good. You guys in my live stream you were asking me like what are some of the things I'm gonna miss when I leave Japan and Gyoza is one of them. When I leave Japan, I'm gonna miss not having this amazing, fresh, cheap gyoza. I'm hoping where I live in Melbourne is gonna have a gyoza joint that's cr pretty affordable because like, I need that in my life, you guys. I got this last time I went grocery shopping, but it's like these jumbo chunks of sushi rolls with like a, kind of like a, a mashed tuna with some sauce on it. Oh, it's pretty good, it's all right. Um, they're really big though, so I'll probably have one or two, and that will be like my lunch, and then for dinner I'll probably make a salad, because that's usually how I roll. Um, for breakfast today I had some random frozen food out of my fridge, and it was like two pieces of like squid. That's <laughs> so random. But I was busy filming this look for you guys, I was busy. And then, I bought a lot you guys, because um, stocking up. The usual yogurt, because eating yogurt's really good if you have a sense of stomach. I picked up pasta sauce it's been so long since i've had a regular tomato basil pasta sauce was my favorite for the longest time but then i binged it and i got tired of it and stopped eating it that's usually what i do i'll be in love with a sort of food and i'll eat it non-stop for like a year consistently and then i hate it so i picked this up for my spaghetti noodles so that you know around the end of the month when we're clearing everything out we have we have this as backup food and then lastly i picked up two cartons of almond milk light uh, i really like this one it's pretty good light doesn't really have much sugar in it. it has a little bit but not much and yeah it's affordable got this i only eat it in my coffee um yeah it's pretty good so yeah you guys i'm going to eat my food and put all this stuff away i hope you enjoyed today's grocery shopping vlog sorry that's all there is to today's vlog just because um as you know I'm trying to save money but at the same time i do have to eat or i'm gonna die so <laughs> that's all i could afford to do recently um trying to save money otherwise i'm gonna go out tomorrow or the next day if the weather's good we'll see and buy those things that my boyfriend requested from the drugstore and I think I'm gonna stock up on like sunscreen because I love Japanese sunscreen. It's pretty good. The Biore one for any of you Asian beauty skincare addicts out there. Love it. Love it. So probably get that and another setting powder because I don't have any setting powders. And like things that I want before I leave that are hard to get in any other country. So yeah, that's what's gonna be happening in the next vlog. So definitely stay tuned to that. And um, if you missed it, check out the previous video was my live stream Q&A. Um, so if you want to kind of check that out, like go ahead. Um, it's just me answering your guys' questions and eating random cherry blossom themed food. So definitely check that out if you guys are curious. And uh, let me know if you want to see more of those live streams. I'll probably only do them once a month to be honest. Uh, yeah. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!